Hey guys, what's up? Brendan Milley here, back with another Jackal Warehouse unboxing. Oh, oh, there you go. That's right, I got about $54 for this stuff off Tackle Warehouse. Now all of these are hard baits and I got these kinda for the fall season. Um, right now the fishing is really good. So I got a bunch of stuff that will hopefully help me catch fish this fall. So let's take a look at what I got. I'm starting a new trend uh, in unboxing videos. I'm gonna use a pen to open the box instead of a knife. So this is groundbreaking material right here. Let me turn it this way so you guys can see. Look at that. Here's it right open. Let me open this up. Okay, so first off, I got a red eye shad, a silent one. Uh, I have one with rattles, but I wanted to get a silent one because the lake that I'll be doing some fishing on has uh, a lot of pressured fish. So sometimes a bait without rattles can do really well. So I got this Straight King red eye shad here. This is in just like a gold color. I'm not sure what it's a. Just gold and black right here. So really, really excited about to use that. I also got a bait here. This is a live target square bill bluegill. Uh, I had one of their lipless crankbaits. It was a bluegill and it caught me some nice fish. I unfortunately lost it and I was kind of ticked about that because these baits are expensive. But I got another bluegill pattern and this one is in metallic. metallic gloss and uh, this should do really well I also got some other square bills a KVD 1.5 crankbait right here this is in gold shad right here so I got that I also got another 1.5 in a perch color so really excited about that then I got a really cool bait the Arashi Arashi I don't know how you, I don't know how you pronounce it top walker 11 right here. This is a really cool topwater bait. Can't wait to use it this fall. This is in Bluegill. It's a really sick color and I'm pretty sure this will catch me some nice fish this year. And last but not least, the most expensive lure that I paid for is the Lucky Craft Jay Jr. Now I was watching Fishing the Midwest and he took some prop baits out um, this fall and caught some really nice fish with them so I had to pick a prop bait. So this is what I grabbed. By the way, if you want to check out that video, I'll link it up there. Because if you don't watch Fishing the Midwest videos, you, you should is what I'm trying to say. You should watch his videos because they're really cool. So there you go, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. A small order, but I cannot wait to get out on the water and use these awesome baits. Thanks for watching this video. And as always, this is Brendan Miller signing out.